Welcome viewers, in this video we will see the solved problem based on the Telegon's theorem. Subscribe the channel for more videos and notifications. Soft copy of this material available in the drive. The link is given in the description box. Now we will go to the topic. Verify the Telegon's theorem for the network shown below. We need to verify the Telegon's theorem for the network given in the problem. Now we will see the network. So this is the network given. One voltage source is available. Here one inductor, resistor, capacitor and another resistor, here one capacitor is available. So the voltage across and current flowing, all the details are given. V1 to V6, similarly I1 to I6. And this network is given, the naming is given. P, Q, R, T, U. This is X, Y. This terminal is both are same, so that there is no name is available. So P, Q, or Tu and this one is Xy. So the voltage V1, the source voltage is V1 and current is I1. This inductor voltage is V2, I2. For this branch Qt, the current is I3, voltage is V3. For Qr, we have capacitor, voltage is V4, I, current is I4. For Pt, one more resistor is available, voltage is V5, current is I5. And this XY, one capacitor is available, voltage is V6 and current is I6. What is the Telegon's theorem? Telegon's theorem states that in any network, the sum of power, instantaneous power is equal to 0. Sum of the power means voltage into current, power equal to V into I. So the summation of V into I equal to 0 for any network, either normal power or complex power. So we need to verify that. The sum of power available in this network, this V into I is equal to 0. That for that we are going to analyze the voltage. We are, we are going to analyze the voltage for each and every loop. That should be equal to what is the, what is the voltage given. Similarly, the loop current, we are going to verify the loop current. right? So instead of power, we are going to verify voltage of each and every loop and current of each and every loop. That should be equal to 0 or that is given in the, as it is given in the value, right. So V1 is 4 voltage, V2 2 voltage, V3 2 voltage, V4 3 voltage, V5 minus 1 voltage, V6 minus 5 voltage. I1 is 2 ampere, I2 also 2 ampere, I3 4 ampere, I4 minus 2 ampere, I5 minus 6 ampere, I6 4 ampere. Now we will verify, first we will verify the voltage, right. First we will take this loop, P, Q, T, U, P, right. In this loop, this V1 equal to V2 plus V3. The voltage, what we are applied is voltage drop across the element. So we will check later, first we will analyze the circuit, V1 equal to V2 plus V3. Then if you take this loop, Q, R, T, Q, then what is that? V3, this V3 is equal to V4 plus V5, the voltage drop across equal to sum of the voltage drop across this branch. Both are same. Q, T is same as Q or T. Both are connected in parallel. So that V3 equal to V4 plus V5. Then take the another loop. Q, R. Q, R, T, Q. Right. And another one more loop. P, Q, R, Y, X. This loop. If you take this loop, this, uh, this, there is no voltage source. The uh, sum of the voltage is equal to 0. V2 plus V4 plus V6 equal to 0, right. So the first loop V1 equal to V2 plus V3, second loop V3 equal to V4 plus V5, third loop V4, V2 plus V4 plus V5 equal, V6 equal to 0, right. So that we will verify later, now we will analyze. Similarly, we will analyze the current. What is this current I2? I2 is nothing but I3 plus I4. I2 is split into I3 and I4. What about this I4 is split into I5 and I6. What is this I6? I6 is nothing but I1 plus I2, right. So we will verify I2, I4, I6. I2 is nothing but I3 plus I4. I2 equal to I3 plus I4. I4 is nothing but I5 and I6. I5 plus I6. I6 is nothing but I1 plus I2, right. So these three voltages, the voltages in three loop, and current in three loops are now analyzed. We will see the expression, expression for this, right. First, let us consider 
let us see whether the KBL and KCLs are satisfied. That is, Telegon's theorem is telling some instantaneous power is zero, such that it should satisfy the, the KBL, Kirchhoff's voltage law and current law. First, we will see the Kirchhoff's voltage law. First, for the loop PQTUP, we already discussed V1 equal to V2 plus V3. V2 is given 4, V3 is our, sorry, V2 given 2 voltage, V3 also given 2 voltage. So that 2 plus 2, 4 voltage. V1 equal to 4 voltage. Already V1 is given 4 voltage only. Right? So by analyzing the KBL, we will got V1 equal to 4 voltage. Already the given value for V1 also 4 voltage. So it's satisfied. Now similarly for the loop QRTQ, we already discussed V3 equal to V4 plus V5. V4 is 3 voltage. V5 is minus 1 voltage because it is going down. Right? So, 3 minus 1, 2 voltage. V3 is 2 voltage. So, this is also given the value of V3 is 2 voltage. The given value of V3 also 2 voltage. By analyzing the KBL, we got 2 voltage. So, it is satisfied. Right? So, the one more loop is available for the loop of P, Q, R, X, Y, P. So, here the source is not available. So, V2 plus V4 plus V6 equal to 0. So, V2 is 2 voltage, V4 is 3 voltage, V6 is minus 5 voltage, right? It is given in the problem itself. So, 2 plus 3, 5, 5 minus 5, 0, right? So, the equation is satisfied. Hence, KB, KBL is satisfied for all three loops, right? So, we, we, we verified the Kirchhoff's voltage law for all the three loops. First, two, first loop having the source is available. So, that V1 equal to V2 plus V3. In second loop, V3, the both are connected in parallel. So, V3 equal to V4 plus V5. In third loop, there is no source. The total by, by adding all the voltage is equal to 0. So, now we satisfied all three loops will satisfy the Kirchhoff's voltage law. Now, we will go to the Kirchhoff's current law. So, by applying KCL, Kirchhoff's current law for the node P, Q and R respectively, we will get the following equation. We already discussed I6 equal to I1 plus I2. That is, I1 is 2 ampere, I2 also 2 ampere. That is equal to 4. So, I6 is 4 ampere. So, that we will check with the given value. Similarly, I2 equal to I3 plus I4. We already discussed in the network. By diagram, we already explained. So, I3 is 4 ampere, I4 is minus 2 ampere. So, 2 ampere. I2 equal to 2 ampere. I4 equal to I5 plus I6. That is minus 6 ampere. I5 is minus 6 ampere. I6 is 4 ampere. So, minus 6 plus 4 minus 2. Right. So, I6 what we got is 4 ampere. I2 what we got 2 ampere. I4 what we got minus 2 ampere. So, these values are the given values also same. What we are got in this equation that is given values also equal. So, KCL is satisfied for all three nodes. Right. By applying KCL, we got the value of I6, I2 and I4 that is very equal to what is the value given in the problem also. So, that it satisfied the KCL. Now, we will verify the instantaneous power that is the important point of the Telegon's theorem. K equal to 1 to 6. There are 6 nodes, 6 uh, networks available, 6 uh, branches are available. V1 to V6, similarly I1 to I6. VK, IK equal to 0. This is the mathematical expression of the Telegon's theorem. Right? So, that summation of k equal to 1, v k i k equal to 0. So, in this problem, k equal to number of branches that is equal to 6. So, that summation of k equal to 1 to 6, v k i k. That is, we have to apply from 1 to 6. v 1 into i 1 plus v 2 into i 2 plus v3 into i3 plus v4 into i4 plus v5 into i5 plus v6 into i6 right so from 1 to 6 branches are available now we need to substitute all the values v1 i1 4 into 2 v2 i2 2 into 2 v3 i3 2 into 4 v4 i4 3 into minus 2 i4 is minus 2 v5 i5 minus 1 minus 6 v6 i6 minus 5 into 4 so, we got 8 plus 4 plus 8 plus minus 6 plus 6 minus 20, right? So, by adding all this value, 
what we got is 0 right see this uh, this 6 minus 6 got cancelled 8 plus 4 12 12 plus 8 20 this is minus 20 is there yeah, so it got 0 right so the, that is the important statement of the telegon theorem instantaneous power in any network is equal to 0 and also it should satisfy kvl and kcl this already we verified if this network satisfy the kvl and kcl and also it satisfied the instantaneous power is zero hence the telegon theorem is proved for the given problem is give for the problem given so in this problem we verified the telegon theorem that is we verify with kcl kvl then instantaneous power Subscribe the channel for more videos and notifications. Soft copy of this material available in the drive. The link is given in the description box. Thank you for listening.